Hi guys, it's Faith. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about how to make friends in college. And these are kind of like my tips on how I made friends in college. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, when I first came to college, I didn't have the best of friends. I honestly had shitty friends. They were like not the best people. And that's like no tea, no shade. It just wasn't the best people for me. And so like, I feel like when you're going to college, you feel like you're gonna meet your day one, your BFFs, your like homies for life. But it's not really gonna be like that. You're gonna have to just, I'm sorry if you can hear those noises are working on the fence outside. You're gonna have to like ease into it, you know, meet people, see how it goes, see how you vibe out. But you're not gonna meet your day one BFFs the first day. And it's okay to be alone in college because that's how I was. I spent a lot of time alone watching Sex in the City eating my dorm food in my room. Just gonna say that, but I do have some tips that helped me develop friendships and to meet new people and broke me out of my shell. Let's get started. My first tip is to say hi to everyone and like the 10 foot rule. So the say hi to everyone in the 10 foot rule thing that I learned about in a podcast which I thought was really, really cool and I never heard or thought about this idea before. So basically what you do is when people are 10 foot away from you and you guys make eye contact, you say hello and you do a kind gesture like, oh hey, or let me get the door for you or whatever. Um, that's a good way to make relationships to meet people that live in your your residence hall because you know like those people that you're probably seeing probably live in the same dorm as you it's gonna feel weird at first but honestly like after practicing and practicing doing that it's not gonna feel as weird and you're just gonna get the hang of it and it's gonna be like second nature to you to just say hi to everybody and it was hard for me at first don't get me wrong because I'm in a whole new freaking area and I have no idea what I'm doing. I ended up practicing it and it helped me out in the long run. Another thing is, is that there was an open door policy my freshman year of college. And basically what that means is that people would leave their door open and kind of like talk to people and like, oh, I love your bedding or oh, whatever about your room. And that was a kind of a cool way to make new friends. Obviously it could be kind of weird for people to like have their door open and it might be a weird concept for some people, but I don't know. I think having your door open and like having like that open connection, that open door, I don't know, would make it easier to people to talk to and meet you and be like oh my god your room's so cute like where's your bedding from and like that can spark a conversation easy way to start a conversation and i feel like it kind of compliments them makes them feel comfortable talking to you and like freshman year you are scared to talk to people and like you're in a whole new environment and it's crazy like it's such a weird feeling and only someone that's gone through that can kind of like know what that feels like. Another thing is to invite your roommate to go do things as well as go to the CA events, the residence hall events, like your RA events, whatever. Those are really cool because they usually have like free food or free things and stuff that you can take home with you. And I feel like those events are so much fun because you get to meet other people in the dorm. You might get free food, take your roommate with you, take some people that you know in your hall, and you can all make new friends. So at these events, make sure you're being like bubbly and fun and don't like not be yourself. Like, if you're not bubbly, don't be bubbly, but try to be a little bit more outgoing than normal and say hi to people. Don't kind of have an RBF because I know that sometimes I feel like I have an RBF sometimes. And so I try not to have that when I'm around people and I'm trying to make friends. I try to just like smile, seem like I'm having a good time and I'm positive energy. It's good to like talk to people and meet them because those are people you're gonna be with for the rest of the year. And so building that good connection in the first couple of weeks is a good thing. You have them throughout the whole year to talk to. All right guys, that's it for today's video um i don't really have much other tips than that it's kind of like a trial and error with this type of thing like making friends but honestly if you're talking you're trying to get out of your room and you know have the open door policy i feel like making friends will come even if your roommate sucks and your roommate doesn't want to do anything there's maybe there's another girl in front of you that wants to do stuff or whatever put yourself out there it's hard it's awkward it's weird but it works out and you make new friends that way i hope you guys liked today's video if you did make sure to subscribe to my channel i would love you guys to stick around Around. I don't usually do college videos for this August time period. I'm going to be doing them, but I also do vlogs, um, mainly vlogs, about my post grad life because I did graduate from Texas Tech University. I will talk to you guys in the next video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like I said. Like I said, what I said. All right, I'm gonna go. Bye, guys. Bye.